guys, happy Sunday. So we are in the van right now, and we just came back from brunch with my family. So it's a little bit, two o'clock in the afternoon. And um, I will show you sort of the inside of the van um, in a little bit, but this is pretty much, as you can see, clean slate, clean slate with enhancements. And it is now ready for um, sanding to be painted. And I think that's really the last big step before we need to um, take care of the aesthetics of it. So we are um, just prepping to uh, to sand it, which I'm not a big fan of, but it has to be done. So um, that's what we're going to do this afternoon. So there's the door. We sort of removed the stepping. There's a step ladder there. We're using that as our step stool to get in. But right outside to the left is like this full closet um, for, I guess, hanging clothes. So I'm stepping in. Um, Ryan's working in the drawer, but to the right here is a dinette set. And that used to have a table, but that has been removed um, because we need to sand it to prep it for painting. But I guess you can convert that to a actual bed. We won't need that because there's the two of us. So that's going to be a full-time dinette set. And there's the kitchen. I One of the requirements as well is a full-size fridge because most of them come with like this little uh, fridge and that just wasn't going to cut it. So full kitchen sink. And walking to the right, this is the frame for a full-size queen bed. And... There's the water tank, storage, um, I think that's going to be accessible from the outside. So we also didn't want a um, bed that we had to um, fold every night and fold back in and all that. We wanted a full-time bed. Um, so yeah, we um, did the frame for that. I'm just turning around here. And you look over there, is the bathroom. And it's a full uh, shower, bath, tub. And again, it's from 19 Forgotten. So the white has turned into yellow. Uh, we'll fix that. We'll find a way to fix that. Sink and a full um, a toilet as well. So it's a pretty big size bathroom, especially just for two people. Um, so we're pretty happy with that. And... So, I am not your father. <laughs> All right, I have to go in for a second. My <laughs> hands are like vibrating, but um, I need to get something to drink. So um, yeah, you know, we're, we're sanding. Ryan's putting an extra door for the um, 
uh, some more storage. And, oh no, it's out of beer. I'm looking at the bar here. I know he has some more. Um, and the sanding isn't as bad as I thought. It's just, you know, your arms get tired and you just start shaking. Um, I, we lived in a big house growing up and there was a lot of kids in that house. And every, you know, few years we would have to paint the house and we would prep the house by sanding. Oh, and it was just like by hand, one of those sandpaper things. So, um, I was dreading it was going to be like that, but it's not too bad. There are going to be some areas that we're going to have to do some personal sanding on it, but, um, the majority of it, um, it's just that, you know, the electric sander. So just taking a quick break here, remove the <laughs> shaking from my hand, but, um, then it's back, it's back out there, but you know, it's, it's coming along. We're, we're getting there. thousand years later okay so three hours thereabouts of standing and we put the outdoor storage door up so that's done there are still some spots <laughs> just because we couldn't uh, I couldn't find the plug over there but um, a lot of the trailer has been sanded all the way to the bathroom so i think we'll probably do one more round because again you know move the wires to sand it but um yeah i think one more round and next free weekend we shall start painting so major milestone and then and there's the this door it only came with that door we put that door so it is storage that goes under the bed the water tank to the right but perfect freaking frack next to each other um but yeah i think that should be good for sunday night and we shall go inside and celebrate i will see you tomorrow bye